Hello, my name is Joseph Runsthrew. I am uh, a Cinnaboyne from the Fort Peck Reservation in northeastern Montana. Currently, I live in uh, Vernal, Utah. I, uh, I teach sixth grade language arts at Roosevelt Junior High School. And I was asked to uh, share a little bit with you about, uh, about what the drum means to me and, and maybe share a little bit of an example of, of how to play the drum. Excuse me, I've got my dogs back here with me. I like to play around them as much as possible just so that they know that the drum's not anything to be afraid of. The drum is something that has been really important to me through, through my whole life, as long as I can remember. Before my, my parents got a divorce, one of, one of my most cherished memories that I have is, is sitting around the drum as a family, learning songs, singing together, uh, making mistakes, and getting better. After my parents divorced, um, we didn't really have a drum in our house for a really long time. We had a we had a couple drums, um, but they were just in in really bad shape. Um, they didn't really work the way that I wanted them to. Um, and so I spent a really long time, you know, asking my mom to get us a new drum, get us a drum that we could use um, as a family again. And when I was in high school, she she eventually did get a drum. Um, and it's, it's a pretty big investment. Drums are not cheap. And when she got a drum, we, we, it was one of our big Christmas presents and, and we started to practice again and, and we were pretty terrible, uh, but we had a lot of fun with it. And I think that was the most important part to me was that it was something that we could do as a family to stay connected to each other, also to our ancestors, to our heritage, our roots. The drum is my connection to our mother earth. Um, it, you know, it represents the heartbeat of the earth, but but also it's the heartbeat of our people. Um, it, it's been said that if the drum stops beating, that will be the end of our people, that, that we live on as long as the drum is beating, keeping that heartbeat alive. Um, so I do my best, even though I, you know, I'm, I'm not the, the greatest singer. I'm not the, the best singer ever, um, but I try to do my best. Um, to respect the drum and and to carry on that tradition of keeping that heartbeat alive. My drum, if you can't tell, it's, it's pretty striking red color with the black top here. I've named it after the prairie fire. Onaya in uh, Nakoda, Assiniboine, means to start a prairie fire. You might think of, of prairie fires as a bad thing, but uh, they, they bring new life to the prairies. They, they get rid of some older growth that, that makes way for, for new life. Um, and so that's what I try to do is, is start new life with my singing, start my, you know, get rid of any negative energy that I've got with me, any, any of the negative things that, that life has, um, and start new every time that I drum. So <clears throat> I'm going to sing you just a little bit of the drum song that I wrote for my drum. Um, and I hope you enjoy. Again, the, the drum is very meaningful to me. Um, I try to do everything in regards to the drum in, in, a, in a good way, a respectful way. Um, and I hope that as you're learning about the drum and, and trying to connect with that part of our heritage, uh, that you'll do the same. Thank you.